Estrella right off the mat, uh, win against Chase Pammy for third in the mini tournament. Uh, Josh, talk, talk a little bit about the, the semifinal match and, and uh, you know, what went into that loss. You know, it was the heart, heartbreaking loss. I mean, trained four years for this moment, this opportunity, and uh, I just I thought I was winning with 30 seconds left. I didn't know because the Matt official gave me one, but the other two guys gave uh, Metcalf one. So, I mean, I can't challenge I just didn't know. and. I, uh, I stopped wrestling and tried to, you know, hold off for the win. And 18 seconds left, I realized I was losing, and uh, just couldn't, I couldn't execute, I couldn't penetrate. Um, but you know, I was always taught you never give up and come back in third. You know, I think it's a combat if you don't. So I just wanted to make my family proud. I got a lot of support here. So uh, finished my career off with uh, with a thin third place finish. This is just the last we're going to see a Josh Strella wrestle. I mean. As of now, I think so, but I mean, you never know what can happen in the future, you know, see some of these older guys get the itch to come back, so as of right now, I think this this will be it. Uh, how much, how important was it for the pride, the pride factor to yeah, come back? it's huge, it's it's pride, I mean, it's just never give up attitude, it's, you never quit, and uh, and that's that's what I had to do, I mean, yeah, you're, 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 the whole goal is to be on the Olympic team, and once that falls short, you stop feeling bad for yourself, and you pick it up real quick, and you uh, come back and take third, and and then you can worry about, uh, you know, being in the bad mood later on. It's just no time for that. Uh, your life, you know, has been dedicated the last four years. You know, went right from Michigan, right into this this training phase. Now you guys got this amazing club yeah. up there. You it's got awesome. the Bonnet facility. Yep. Do you think that that's something that, that could keep you in it potentially? I mean, potentially. I mean, I love wrestling. I mean, that's why I've been doing it ever since I graduated college. You know, wait, you know, I didn't meet the goals and expectations I had for myself in college. So it was a driving force to keep me going on internationally. And, uh, you know, I fell short again, but it, it was a great experience. And um, I wouldn't take it away. Um, I would never take away that experience. I, uh, you know, you just learn a lot about yourself and make great friends. And it's just a great journey traveling the world. So, um, yeah, I could, I mean, being there, I'd like to, you know, stay around and see what, what opportunities I have to maybe coach and, and help train the guys. What would your dad and your brother say to you after that, that last match? I uh, just they're proud of me. I mean, we have a really tight family, and uh, you know, they're they're just a huge support staff for me. So, you know, they're just proud of the way I come back, and and uh, just have just a really good family that supports me really well. What, are you gonna do family business? What, 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 you know, what? I don't know. I, I think I'd like to coach college. So, uh, we'll see what the next steps are here. Why not? Now, different opportunities. But uh, I, I'd definitely love to coach, and uh, you know. Help out some guys, you know, meet their goals and, and aspirations, and and uh, I'd like to be a part of that. Uh, Ann Arbor, Novi, Florida. Where are, you, where are you going next? It doesn't really matter. I mean, I'd love to stay around the Michigan program, but uh, you know, I'm gonna look at wherever the opportunities are and see what happens. The last thing, how how much of an impact has Sean Bormat and Donnie Pritzoff coming in, Andy coming back? Yeah, it's how, how much has that helped? It's been great. I mean, Sean's been my personal freestyle coach the last four years, so. It fell. It kind of fell on my lap. I mean, because I was I had to reevaluate my situation after last year and go where training partners were, and they had something kick. They kick started something at uh, overtime in Naperville, Illinois. But uh, you know, Sean took the position. Herbert and Wood and Jimmy Kennedy and how these guys came in, Tyrell Todd, and uh, just you know, together like as as a team. I mean, we really helped drive each other every day in practice, and that was a huge part. And for Matt and and. and uh, Prince off are just great guys, great motivators, and they, they expect nothing but your best effort out there every single time, and I think that's what they bring to the program. All right, I lied one more. The Chirellas, I've never heard you guys make one complaint about anything. Your brother got absolutely hosed in the NCAA Finals um, today. A lot of people are saying, you know, you got hosed with Metcalf. Do you feel that way? You know what? I, I, I don't know. You got to leave it all on the mat, and if it's not enough, and it's going to come down to a questionable call then uh, that's what's going to happen. I mean, you can't put yourself in that situation. I needed to penetrate, and I needed to attack and score, and I couldn't get to his leg on that in, in those instances. But uh, you know what, I don't know. I think life's just, there's a lot more than wrestling. So you can uh, dwell on it, look back. Some guys will kill themselves over it. I mean, I kill himself, but just eat, eat them themselves eat up. up. Yeah. And uh, I just try not to live my life that way. I have a lot more important things. I have a great family, great wife. and. Uh, you know, it's just it's just a part of wrestling. Just move on and give all the glory to God, and that's 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 why I try to come back and get third. You know, because it's more, it's it's more important than just yourself. It's it's for a higher power. So for me, it is. All right, it's been a pleasure watching you, man. Hopefully, we'll see you in the future. Thank if you. not, good luck on your next endeavor. Thank you. I appreciate it.